This is Dr. Phil Chavez. Brothers, I want to wish you a very happy new year. Now to make some relevant points, I would like to talk about the origins of the new year, especially in the Western world. Now the ancient Romans were the first to start the new year with the month of January. And it was Julius Caesar who advocated for the first. Now the month is named after the god Janus or Janus. That term comes from the Latin Janua, meaning door or gate or entrance. Now the Roman god Janus had two faces looking in opposite directions, such that he could look back at the past and look ahead to the future. All doors, entrances, and gateways in the empire were committed to his protection. Now deep down, men aspire to be better on every level, and so, in the pursuit of personal growth, they look back to the past to reckon with what must be improved or eliminated, and moving ahead, they set goals to reach renewal or expansion. For the Christian, this fulfills our Lord's admonition. You must therefore be perfect as your heavenly Father is perfect. So brothers, making New Year's resolutions is proper if not necessary. It's not sufficient just to cross one's fingers and hope for the best. Moving forward with a conscious desire to advance in Christ, I believe stands as essential. So brothers, as St. Paul says, be renewed in the spirit of your minds and make this upcoming year better than the past one, setting new aims to look more like Christ. Now brothers, if people do not make New Year's resolutions, they probably wouldn't make much improvement. Sure, many have fears about the necessary sacrifices to reach success, but we owe it to God to make attempts to grow in perfection. Each year has a dimension of adventure whereby one must journey with courage, like Abraham or Moses or Joseph, unaware of the precise end or destination. Yet these were assured of God's guiding hand. I just love that quote from Abraham Lincoln. Having chosen our course without guile and with pure purpose, let's renew our trust in God and go forward without fear and with manly hearts. Brothers, God be with you, especially this new year.